been so intense up to this point that I haven't really done anything where I've just been sitting and talking. I don't know why I find it less interesting when someone, ah, I don't know if I find it less interesting. You know what, I think I find it more common, less novel. It's really not about what you say, it's how you present it. You know, when, when, you're, when you're up and moving, I don't know, it's all bullshit. I think if, it's, if it comes out real, then that's all that matters. I don't think it matters where you say. I do think it matters if you're making eye contact. A lot of people that I've been seeing everyone essentially i mean people have a hard time with eye contact it's it's weird to make eye contact and keep looking at someone you know there's the point where it's like uncomfortable and you look away and then you come back to it i've been noticing when i do it these days like someone will say something about like their girlfriend something personal and my response, I'll respond like this and then I'll look back. Like, I bl blatantly avoid eye contact for a statement that, a statement like something personal. I, I just, it, it's easier to look away and then come back. And I realize when I do it and I think that's, that's jacked up, man. Why do we do that? Why do we avoid eye contact? Why are we afraid to look at the camera and talk to it? You know, this is our audience right here. This is who. This is who's watching. There's no point in looking over over here, or over here, or up here, or down here, or all around, in a crazy way. That doesn't. That doesn't accomplish anything. Eye contact is very important. I think that's the point of this. I think ultimately, what it comes down to, after all is said and done, is that eye contact is very important always when you're talking to someone or to a camera.